Hey everybody, Dante here. Got a new alarm as a graduation present that for graduating high school a long t a, a while back months ago, a couple months ago. There it is. As you could already tell by its body shape and strobe shape, you could already tell it's an EST integrity. Model number on this is 750 if it'll focus it in. 757 7A RS70. It is one of their re entrant speaker strobe models. Oh, sh instructions manual. Let's open it up. You got your uh, mounting diagram. And you also got the percentage of rated output and all the specs. Installation instructions. Then all your specification table. There's your wiring diagrams for your speaker taps. You got your common and then you got... What's surprising is that this speaker strobe can go up to 15 watts. Start at 2 watts, which is a high, which is the highest of most, which most speaker strobes can go up to 2 watts. Only start at 1 fourth watt and go up to 2 watts. But however, this one starts at 2 watts, and then it's 15 watts. As you can see, it, it has an, it has a, it has, the speaker is made by Atlas Soundalier. It's got an, unlike unlike the other 757 7A RS70 speaker strobes, it has no it has no fire markings and it has an amber lens. No fire markings on the bezel and it has an amber lens. And um, and it does not say UL synchronization UL meets UL. I can't remember what year that, but it does meet. It does meet up. The, it it does meet synchronization requirements, and I never and I didn't see a UL listing on the tag, so that pretty much implies that it's just it it's it is in des, it's not properly designed like like my G4S seven VM, which is in my collection tote. It has the re entrant speaker because if you want to see uh. Instead of the basic EST speaker that EST makes with for with their both their Integrity series and their Genesis series, if you want to see one of the more basic speakers, check out my videos with the G4WAS two VMA or the G4S seven VM. The G4S seven VM appears more frequently, but it but you can see this little chart here. Or if you want to see the high fidelity speaker that EST makes, check out my videos with the G C H F W N S two VMA. A. You can see why is your con your your chart it says the white wire is your common, red red is two watts, gray is or silver is four watts, brown is 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 8 watts and in green is 15 watts and that's I wonder how loud that is is but it is a 70 volt speaker as implied by the model number RS70 well the RS also implies that it's a um is a um uh also implies that it's a re-entrant speaker. You can see it says Edwards GS. That was before Edwards got bought by GE Security, which was also before the UT, the United Technologies Corporation era when Edwards was bought by United Technologies Corporation and GE Security. So, and and that implies that this this was made in conjunction with the uh with also with the like first to first first to second generations first and second generations of the Genesis series 
but this is an enhanced integrity as you can see so which means it is actually so which means at that time when this was being made the genesis series was already out and the strobes were enhanced to the point where they're where they're synchronizable where they're synchronized but not to the same extent as smart sync true alerts because they would operate free run unlike smart sync true alerts which rely on a synchronization protocol to run but however but but um as you could see but that also mean but it also but it was also can be made but there were but the enhancement is also it was impl it, but it's also implied the the strobe enhancement what allows these to be synchronizable with the genesis series so this was when synchronization was out unlike uh, the unlike models like the predecessor like this like like the 792 732 and 765 which which used a different body style but had the iconic integrity strobe that was that was that was obviously before synchronization of course as you can see there's your mounting plate i have it attached and then yeah but like I said, the speaker was man manufactured was not originally manufactured by Edwards. It was originally manufactured by Atlas Soundelier. But the body and the strobe were manufactured by Edwards, so it is an Edwards device, but just with an, a speaker made by Atlas Soundelier. And then it uses pigtail connectors instead of terminal blocks, because that terminal block is for your wattage. So, anyways, thank you for watching.